at a distance of 554.5 light years from our terrestrial ball, there is a variety of organisms on planet called Argon, orbiting in Antares system. One this planet dominated with intertual species called Argonians, technology is growing at a rate, which is a hundred times the one on our planet. Curiosity, passion in discovery and collaboration, are the top factors helping this Argonian population to advance in technology at this remarkable rate. There is no many natural landscapes here, but advanced design skyscrapers and other infrastructures, are dominant on the surface. Such gigantic structures cover 60% of the entire planet, while only 40% is covered by liquid water, and other rocky lands. Those conditions drive citizens of this planet, to focus on discovery of easy intergalactical traveling and observation technologies, to find other habitable places, where they can find natural world with amazing landscapes. It is not only about tourism, but also the planet is running out of natural resources. There is no such things of countries and continents, their world became one through technology, the only limit they have, is their atmosphere. Using advanced technology systems, it is easier to know everyone's address, based on what is known as, sections. A series of events takes place in different sections, but what happened in section 124, was iconic. Section 124 is a section, where main research centers are located. It is a place of great scientists working on various discoveries. It is hard to identify their faces, as they are covered by robots linking their minds, with supercomputers. Their civilization, started 4000 years ago, as counted based on their time system. One year on Argon, is equal to Earth's three months. In 1000, one of the Argonian scientists pointed its telescope to the solar system. It was a time to find new worlds, orbiting our main squint star. Unfortunately, this Argonian couldn't get clear image of our solar system, it could only see hazy images, and detect single, largest planet, Jupiter. This wasn't the end, but was a beginning of a great adventure, however, this Argonian thought that it would handle this alone, as it did on other planet systems. A telescope based on surface failed to meet this Argonian's expectations, but there are hundreds of telescopes, orbiting around the planet. To access those telescopes, this Argonian had to request for access from her authority. It was frustration to find new planet system and fail to capture clear image for further studies. This made it difficult for this Argonian to know where to start, while explaining main reason she wants access to advanced telescopes. As it is done on Argon, this Argonian reached to the authorities, and she was supposed to stand in front of a panel and present her request. With one one image of the sun with small black dot, Jupiter, it was a big challenge to convince the panel. An album of five different images was required. At this time, the Argonian had to take other images. When she tried so, she observed no change as Jupiter doesn't orbit the sun, and also other planets are so small. An upgrade for the telescope of this Argonian was required. This telescope was not made of lens, but radiation receivers and converters, made in element called lampium, which was among extincting elements on the planet. Even though the planet is united, no thing is granted for free. This Argonian had to work for money to buy new lampium and upgrade her telescope. To find this treasure, 
this Argonian had to work for others in their research. Luckily, her scientist friend was completing a study of Sirius' planet system. He was only remaining with tasks that would take two Argonian years. Left with no other choice, this alien joined her friend for this period of two years. It was not that easy, as strange and unhabitable planets are the ones found in this planet system. Only commitment this Argonian had, helped her to complete the job. Luckily, she earned enough money to upgrade the telescope. This was the time to use Lampium and discover new worlds. After those two years, the alien was able to capture the image, but the Earth was behind the sun the time when she was taking images. She managed to pass the panel, and get access to advanced telescope. Her access was to expire after one year. This time, Earth wouldn't have became clear to any Argonian telescope. After a period of one Argonian year, Mars was found to be most habitable one, compared to other observed planets. This wasn't far from reality, as this alien didn't get a chance to study Earth, which was closer to the sun's rays. This wasn't an exciting moment, to make this alien start thinking of how to visit Mars. The project was closed, but other science departments continued to expand. One of the department was Computer Science Department. It became Game Changer of Section 124 Story. This was a department, which was new in this section. Scientists in this department focused on 3D modeling and cyber security. It is characterized by consulting different captured images, and create different 3D models. Scientists of this department also, learn how to enter in others' computers, and access different files. They also try to find a way of protecting them. One day, a scientist who was somewhat passionate about space studies, tried to grab some space images, and create some models from them. All interest wasn't mainly focused on big and clear objects, but small details were of interest. This is how Earth was cleared from sun's rays and become clear. This computer engineer, was only interested in transforming a small object into visible object model. Now, a computer engineer discovered new habitable place. This wasn't that big deal for the engineer. His job was done, even though he had other information hacked from astronomers' computers. The model itself was amazing, but the action performed was marvelous. This engineer had a friend who works in astronomy department. They used to share almost everything. This model, together with the other pictures taken by the other scientist, were shared too. The excitement of this astronomer, drove him in a fraud unknowingly, and start to study the solar system, using other scientists' data.